We have the latest homicide numbers for the city of Mobile. The newest count shows homicides in Mobile are up compared to this time last year. Our Ashlyn Mitchell joining us now and Ashlyn only a little over a month left in the year here. Yeah, that's right, Cameron. Mobile police say there have been 32 homicides in the city limits so far this year. In fact, Mobile is on track to equal or exceed last year's total, which was 33 homicides overall. A 15 year old boy killed a father allegedly shot to death by his own daughter and a woman's body found on the side of the road. These are just a few of the gut wrenching homicides Mobile has seen in the last few weeks. Even one homicide is too many, so uh, they're all unacceptable, um, but we have to work as hard as we can to seek justice. With a little over a month left in the year, Mobile Police Chief William Jackson says Mobile sits at 32 homicides compared to 26 during this same time last year. Some Mobile citizens say that number doesn't sit well. So you would say 32 homicides is too many? Too many. When they stop with the uh, physical permits, that opened up the doors for a lot of people to do what they do with guns. That's a lot to me. That's a lot. That's a lot. It's a big number to me. I feel like it should be less. Anything over the number zero on the homicide list is a bad number. Of the 32 homicides, Chief Jackson says six of them are domestic related. We've definitely seen an uptick in domestic related crime altogether. And he says this year's current data shows shooting deaths are usually not at random. Of the 32 homicides, there's only one homicide that has occurred where the parties were not known to each other. He adds that four of the 32 homicide cases are currently unsolved, but that his homicide unit is working tirelessly to find answers. But despite the uptick, Chief Jackson says there's a silver lining when it comes to the weapons used in this year's homicides. We've had no homicide in 2024 involving a Glock switch. They were more prevalent last year. They've slowed up a little bit this year, which is a good sign. I'd like to say it's because of the prosecution of it on the federal side. And as for outside the city limits, a spokesperson with the Mobile County Sheriff's Office tells me there have been 13 homicides in Mobile County so far this year. On the other side of the bay, a captain with the Baldwin County Sheriff's Office tells me Baldwin County has seen 11 homicides during 2024 alone. Reporting live in studio, Ashley Mitchell, Fox 10 News.